What is going on? We are obviously gonna be doing a little bit more professional videos for you guys instead of going live every single time. And uh, we got our computer over here. So essentially we uh, used to go live, but we're not gonna be going to live anymore because I noticed that I majored in minor things. The minor things of, yeah, content is great. Obviously for the personal YouTube channel, I'm not doing this for money. I'm not monetizing this channel at all. You know, there is no gear, there is no merch, there is no ads, there is no seminars, there is no ebook, there is no book, there is no nothing, there is no course. Um, and that was one of the things is I, I was, I, I really like doing this, but I noticed that it wasn't the money making and it wasn't the business building that I wanted. It wasn't the empire building. And that was part of me actually understanding that, you know what, I was majoring in minor things. So what's what's the, the reason behind this? There's two people that really come to mind. There's two books I should talk about. Number one is Gary Keller's The One Thing. Everyone already knows that, that's super easy. Um, it's just, you come to work and you just, list your priorities and you just do that one thing you don't want to do and you do it every single day. The 80-20 rule obviously applies. What is that number one thing for me? And then you have the arch stone and then they have that, that stone at the top that literally keeps the entire bridge together. And that is the piece, that's the puzzle. What, what's your one stone that you need to have in place every single day to be successful? For me, it's waking up and going to the gym and just busting my ass at the gym. Because if I'm not, that, that's a, a massive, just sliding into a sluggish day, not as in energetic. You know, I just, I, my energy is totally different, just in general. So that's, that's number one. Number two is uh, Brian Tracy. Brian Tracy has a great book out there called Eat That Frog, Eat That Frog, which is unbelievable. It's, he's saying that if you have the ugliest frog out there, the ugliest frog is that project you don't want to do, going to the gym, waking up early, you know, saying hi to someone that you don't want to say hi to, networking or emailing or following up or whatever that is. What is that number one thing that you do every single day, just like Gary Keller was talking about it, but that ugly frog that you don't want to eat and you just do that and you start your day and, and once you accomplish that, every other frog doesn't look that bad. Every other frog, which is, you know, a follow-up on someone you actually want to follow up with, you know? But if you start with the follow-ups that you want to follow up with, and then you look at that one that you just don't want to do, you know, I'll give you an example. So I'm in real estate. So essentially we have about 10 people I'm willing to call at any time. They're fun, they're engaging, and then you have the people that have big listings, big homes that they're listing. And those owners, they're a little bit more challenging. It's hard to get in touch with them. And, you know, they're, they're obviously, higher priced, higher, not only commission, but just pressure, everything else, it, it just, just wraps up into that envelope of, okay, can you produce? And if you can't produce, then why are you calling me? You know, what's your added value? Why are you better than someone else? And that's essentially what this is, is, okay, if I call them, all these other people that I call, super easy. You know, if I go to the gym, the day is a lot easier. If I eat healthy, the day is a lot easier. So what is, what, what are you majoring in that 80% that is yielding you 20% of the results? Focus on the 20%. What are the 20% that you're doing every single day that's gonna yield you the 80% results? That is the majoring in the major things instead of majoring in the minor things. You know, the minor things are email, texting, calling, social media, you already know it, you know, ne not networking, not, you know, spending too much time on TV, you know, that, that's really what it comes down to. And Les Brown has a great quote I posted on Instagram on yesterday, actually Monday, and he said that if you do what is easy, your life will be hard. If you do what is hard, your life will be easy. That's the exact same, that's just the whole thing wrapped up right there. If you do what is easy, your life is hard. If you pick the ice cream over the salad, you know, what does that mean? That's visceral fat around your body, that's, that's sluggish, that's, that's brain fatigue because the sugar, sugar rests your brain. Um, and then later on, if you keep on doing that, that's diabetes, that could be cancer, that could be a stroke, that could be a heart attack. What are you majoring in every single day that you could either cut out or increase? 
That's really what it comes down to. What are you majoring in? So think about that. Take inventory. You have to take inventory. You know, am I spending too much time not learning? Am I spending too much time not reaching out to people that I should be reaching out to? So have an awesome day. Subscribe to the videos. Uh, hopefully this is uh, not only in focus, but just a, a better way that you guys can uh, receive the information, higher quality. Obviously, you're also going to get the thumbnail and everything else, but that's me getting 1% better. This, this is me majoring in major things, which is my business, and then my side hustle, which is the personal development right here. So I'm going live on uh, my other channel. If you guys are interested, it's a real estate channel. Uh, subscribe to this or that one, which I think both links are below. Have an awesome day. Talk to you guys soon. And I went.